So we are in Target. I came to a different Target today to see if I can find something different. And if you can notice, I am masked up because y'all, COVID is real out here. So, you know, I gotta stay safe, if you feel me? So I'm actually on the Missouri side. I was hoping that they had, I was hoping that they had more stuff, but it really don't look like they do. I definitely want to pick up another one of these because mine I had it I've had it for like a month I think so I am definitely going to pick one of these up so they have a few body scrubs um tree hut body scrubs but they pretty much got all of the same ones so the vitamin c coconut all of these are I pretty much have all these or have smelt all these so I'm not gonna get those we do have the Dr. Teal's uh, melatonin bubble bath and I really have been wanting to get this and try it out for y'all and you know also see if it'll make me go to sleep y'all because I'll be up all night so I'm gonna get this oh y'all so they have the um, EOS lotion if y'all remember this one right here I was not a fan of um, everybody loves this though so if you are a person that likes very very sweet vanilla smells then you would like that but somebody recommended that I try the pomegranate one right here. So I'm gonna smell it. I like this one. She was definitely right. I absolutely love this one. This is the pomegranate and raspberry. So it's gonna be perfect. I think I have a pomegranate body wash by Caress. So it's gonna go perfect with this. I'm not sure if I smoked this one before, but I want to give it a smell to see if I like it. But this is the Sea Kelp OGX body scrub and it has hyaluronic acid in it. And it has like a backdoor medicine smell to me. I don't know if it's just me or what, but I'm not really a fan of that. They do also have the body lotion. I want to smell this to see how it smells. It has shea butter, cocoa butter, vitamin E. So it's really going to help moisturize the skin. So let's smell this. Um, that really smells like Vicks, Vicks Vaporub. That's what this smells like, so I don't know, I don't know if I'm gonna do that. I'm just gonna stick with the body wash. So let's see what else they have. Okay, so Dove has a not sure if y'all have seen this but i have never seen this before it's a refill reuse repeat body wash so you buy this entire thing and then you just buy the refills and they have the cucumber so you just basically add water to it they also have this cute little bottle interesting how much is this so the kit is 15 dollars and the refills are $6.99, but I mean, I can see it, you know, as far as like, it's less plastic and stuff like that, but honestly, the body washes are pretty much the same price. They're actually a little cheaper, so um, I don't know about that. I wonder if it's like more that comes in it though. Interesting. I have this one, which I like, but I have not tried this one. So this one is the stay hydrated one it looks like what is it what scent is this let's let's smell this mm. i do really really like this so y'all now i always come into target and i always see these so let me know if y'all have tried these because i'm very curious so this is the banana and aloe it's supposed to hydrate and replenish it has jojoba jojoba oil and essential oils and it claims to be for all skin types. So, I wonder how this smells. Let's smell it. Oh my God, I'm not mad at this. This smells so good. So that's the banana and aloe. 
this is lavender and vanilla, which that that stank. Let's try the raw body wash. I have tried the um, I think it's the lemon sugar one. I have tried this a while back, um, and it was it was all right. It was all right, but I want to smell this one. This is watermelon and fresh mint. I don't know if I need another watermelon body wash, but oh my god, that smells like a um, like a smoothie from Tropical Smoothie Cafe, y'all. Um, I really like this. Mm, it's six bucks though. We gonna just leave that there. We are trying to be on a budget because y'all, I have been spending way too much money on hygiene. <laughs> In my opinion, it's worth it. So this is the Orchard and Black something. I don't know how to pronounce it, but it's by Olay. So let's move this. Rose water and sweet nectar. I actually really like the Olay B3 body washes. I love the smell of pretty much all of them. I don't think I picked up one that I have not liked. All right, y'all, so you know, I've been wanting this Aveeno body wash. That one kind of smells funny, I don't know. That's weird, I don't remember it smelling like that. But I guess, let's see what Dove has. So, Y'all remember when I picked this up, right? I am all out of this because my boyfriend used it all. So I've been thinking about picking it up again, but honestly, I think I just want to try something else. But I really, really do love this peony and rose oil. Smells so, so good. Is it just me or did Dove change the packaging? Cause I'm sure they did. Oh, I have been wanting to try this Flamingo shave gel. Now y'all know that I really either use my soap or my body wash to shave, but I have been hearing a lot really good things about this so I think I'm gonna get it and try it out so I'm definitely gonna get this okay girl this is $15 but this is a mega bay detoxing underarm mask so it has glycolic acid vitamin C and charcoal so I'm assuming this is gonna help lighten your underarms let me know if y'all have tried this because it sounds like it's something that I would be interested in but not for $16 honey it's $15.99 yeah no okay Oh, they have some Christmas deodorant still out. This is a sugar cookie one. Everybody has been raving about this one. I want to try it, but y'all, $13, I'm on a budget, okay? Y'all know I will come in here and spend so much money, but I can't, I can't justify spending $12 on this, okay? Yeah, no. They definitely need to lower the price. So these are limited edition, but I do want to see if they have the sugar cookie body wash because, uh-uh. I've heard that that one's really good. Let's see if they have it. Nope. Sure don't look like it. It's all right. I definitely need to pick another one of these up because y'all, it smells so good i have fell in love with it so i'm gonna get that but i wanted to see if they had the other one because there was a purple one or a pink one i think last time and i don't think they have it at this one so i think i'm just gonna stick with this one this is peach cupcake by native the packaging number one is so cute but i'm gonna smell this that smells really good if you're into like really sweet stuff you would like that one but they also have this ginger lemon cupcake deodorant then they have mint mint cupcake and then they also have the fresh peach cupcake in the deodorant scent i wonder how that smells they have some uh, a bunch of new fragrances i'm assuming for like just the new season so yeah that's cute Thanks. 
so Dollar Tree is literally just right here. So I'm gonna hop into Dollar Tree, y'all. I have not shopped for any hygiene products in Dollar Tree, so this should be interesting. I did hear that it went up to a dollar and fifty tree, so uh the pandemic just ruined everything. Four total five. So we are in the health and beauty section. They have like the t individual toothbrushes. So if you are more so on a budget, um, I really love these toothbrushes. These are just a dollar twenty-five. Okay, optic white toothpaste. Um, I think I'm actually gonna pick some of this up because I need some new toothpaste. They have the stain eraser one, the sensitive one. So yeah, I think I'm definitely gonna pick this one up though. So this is a two-in-one toothpaste and mouthwash so it cleans teeth and freshens breath i see blast whitening they do also have the charcoal one right here by colgate so if you are more so on a budget um and it, maybe it's just you uh, i would definitely check out dollar tree if you have one near you because they really pretty much have all that you need but just kind of just a little bit smaller and it's like a dollar so i don't know if y'all experienced this when y'all were younger but i used to love coming to dollar tree because everything was a dollar i don't know it just it just made me feel good i was like oh i can get a whole bunch of stuff and my mom and them would still be like put it back like it's a dollar what are y'all talking about they do have some supplements too they got some biotin um probiotics I don't know necessarily they got turmeric I'm not sure how well they perform but they do have vitamins girl they got pregnancy test for you not for me but for you let's smell some of this stuff because honestly I don't think I've ever seen some of these brands before but um they got a cocoa butter body wash right here this is by silken honestly i kind of just want to try these out um i don't yeah no Not that one. so this is a two-in-one moisturizing body wash so let's smell this yo this actually smells really good this is oil of life um I'm a little scared to try that out um but it's probably good it, it probably is good they got some exfoliating washcloths i actually may like this better because it's a little rougher so they have some dove nourishing body cream i think i want to get this but honestly it's just not that much that comes in here so i don't know we'll just get it anyway let's try it out i was hoping that they had some dove body wash in here um but it doesn't look like it they got some VO5. This is a really big bottle. So this is Arm & Hammer. It's baby body wash and shampoo. It's fragrance free. I do kind of want to try this. Definitely not a fan of that. It smells like cardboard. <laughs> and it's half empty. So they got this exfoliating wash mitt. I think this will be perfect for my face, so I'm gonna pick this up. So, also, they have the Dove bar soaps right here. So they have the one that comes in the original scent, the sensitive skin one. So if you are looking for affordable body care, you can pick up some soap. I'm so glad that I came across these because I wanted to pick up some baby wipes. So what happened was I picked up these wipes randomly one day and I hadn't used them. I ran out of tissues. So I started using them and I'm like, perfect. I'm just gonna start using these because I've been wanting to use, start using them anyway. So I'm just completely gonna stop buying tissue. I want the wipes with just water in them. But I don't see any baby wipes. Paraben free, no alcohol, chlorine. Okay, so I think I'm gonna pick up these ones. Um, it's 99% water, so I think these will be perfect. So I'm gonna pick these up.
so I'm in Walmart and it was literally right across the way so I was like let me just go ahead and stop into Walmart see if see if there's anything I can find so now y'all know y'all girl is obsessed with Dove the Dove mango so and this lotion this is the glowing care mango and almond butter oh my god y'all know I gotta pick this up because I already got the body wash or I already got the um, scrub and everything so definitely gotta get that it's completely obsessed with all the products so this is ultra healing all over hydrating shea butter by shea moisture like when did when the hell did they come out with this so this is the pampering care body lotion by dove which also one of, another one of my favorite scents let's see what else they got though so okay so this is the tree hub body scrubs they ain't got none the only ones that they got is cotton candy watermelon so we gonna leave that there oh my goodness this is a sleep spray um I'm gonna get this and I really wanna see if it works, y'all. If y'all tried this, let me know down below because I'm really interested to see if this gonna work. It's only $4, so I'm gonna pick it up. I'm gonna let y'all know how it go. It seems like every time I look at this, it go up in price because I swear it was like $6 and it say it's $8. I really wanna try this though because I have been, I've been wanting to try it, so I'm gonna get it. Have y'all tried these? Because I'm definitely curious and how they smell so this one is what's this one apricot and honey cocoa and almond butter lemon and mint oatmeal and vitamin e let's smell these i can't remember if i smelled this before but again this is oatmeal and vitamin e i mean i think i like this i don't know if it's the smell in here that's giving it a weird kind of smell or if it's that this is the lemon and mint I feel like it just got a weird back door smell, these body washes. I'm too excited. I have been looking for this everywhere and I thought that they like got rid of it or it was like out of season. But this is the brown sugar and cocoa butter Dove body polish. Y'all already know that I'm so obsessed with the Dove body polishes, but I don't know how I feel about it. I feel like it may smell good on me, so I'm gonna pick this up. This is a nighttime rinse off body conditioner with retinol. So is this, this is the one I was telling y'all about in Target. And I wonder how this smells, cause you can't really smell it. So should I pick this up? Should I get this y'all? Cause I do wanna try it out. Cause everybody, obviously everybody raves about this one and I absolutely love it. So I'm definitely on board with it. But I think what I'm gonna do is try out the one, this nighttime one, just because I already have that one. So yeah, I'm definitely gonna pick this one up and try it out for y'all. If you have tried this, let me know down below because um, I'm definitely interested to see how it's gonna go. Chamomile and mango. I really, like I said, I absolutely love this line. Um, it's not the most moisturizing body wash that I've tried. Now, compared to the Dove, I think Dove does a really good job with the moisture in their products. So, yeah. This smells so good. I, I literally love almost every one of these body washes. If y'all watched my last video, y'all see me talk about this and I actually used it. It's all right as far as shaving goes, but washing my body with it, I, I really haven't tried it, but I don't know if I ever will. I might try it out one time to let y'all know how it goes, but this is just basically like a shaving cream in my opinion. They have this Winter Care Dove Body Wash Instantly Moisturizes Dry Skin. That smells good. That actually smells really, really good. So if you are interested in that, I would pick that up. I did want to go ahead and pick up a tongue scraper, so I'm going to pick this up. I ended up going to Target, Dollar Tree, and Walmart. 
and Trader Joe's too. So I'm gonna show y'all what I picked up. So we just gonna go in order like we normally do. I'm gonna start with Target. We gonna move to Dollar Tree, Walmart, and then Trader Joe's. So the first thing that I picked up, I had to pick up some more of the Olay body conditioner right here, y'all. It smells so good. If you have not tried this and you've been wanting to try it, this is your sign. Go ahead and pick it up. It's pretty affordable. I think it's like five dollars. Um, but I absolutely love this. It does have like a perfumey smell. So um, yeah, I think it pairs well with pretty much like any body wash that you use. I really love it. And it does have B3 in it and it has shea butter. So it's gonna give you that extra hydration too. So I went ahead and picked this up. Y'all will see a little bit later. I picked up another one of these just in a different fragrance. So I'll show y'all that too. So I picked up that. Um, I ended up picking up this Flamingo Shave Gel as well right here. Now I've been hearing a lot of good stuff about this shaving cream. Honestly, I typically just use either my, you know, just pretty much my body wash or I like to use conditioner sometimes. So I think this will be good because it does have aloe vera in it and it claims to condition the skin. So if y'all have tried this, let me know down below because I'm definitely interested. I've literally seen it everywhere in I've only heard good things about it. So I did want to check it out and I did want to pick up some of the Flamingo razors, but I was like, yeah, you know, I'm kind of trying to be on a budget. So yeah, but this is how it looks. It almost smells like baby powder a little bit, but it smells really, really good. Oh my God, I really love that. Okay, so this was $4.99. So basically it was $5 and it's a pretty big bottle. I think it's about six ounces. So it's six ounces and shaving cream lasts a long time anyway. So this should last you a while. So I'm really excited to try this out. So I also picked up another one of these uh, exfoliating body cloths, y'all. I absolutely love this. This one is by Eco Tools. Um, if you see one of my other hauls, you did see that I picked this up and I have absolutely fell in love with it. Honestly, my skin is like soft 24 seven because this is something that I use daily. So I would highly recommend you picking one of these up. Um, I think this was $2.99. I did also pick up an exfoliating washcloth from Dollar Tree, which is only $1.25. So if you are looking for something a little bit more affordable, I would go with the Dollar Tree one. But um, yeah, I absolutely love this. This is the Eco Tools one. And basically, you just use it, you rinse it off and you hang dry it. And then it lasts you up to about 30 days. And I've had mine for about a month now. So it was definitely time for me to pick up another one. So I picked up this. I also picked up the pomegranate raspberry EOS lotion. Now, um, in my la in one of my last hauls, I did pick up the vanilla one. It was just way too sweet for me, but this pomegranate and raspberry, it smells so good. <sighs> It does have a little bit of sweetness to it, but it, it's something that I don't mind. Um, it is a little bit thick though, so I'm, I'm curious to see how it's gonna be all over my body. It's supposed to not be greasy or heavy. It's supposed to be lightweight. So if y'all tried this, let me know it down below. One of the girls here on YouTube actually recommended that I try this one instead, so I picked it up. I love the smell of it. I think I'm gonna pair it with my Caress body wash that I picked up. It was a pomegranate one, so I think that'll be cute. I also picked up the Dr. Till's Melatonin and Essential Oil Spray and Bubble Bath. Y'all, I heard that it really does make you relax and wanna go to sleep, so definitely excited to try it out. Um, again, it has melatonin in it. For the spray, you can actually use it in the shower uh, on your actual bed or your body, so I'm definitely gonna let y'all know how this goes and if it really relaxes me and makes me wanna go to sleep because I'm definitely curious about that. So I picked that up. Uh, I did end up going to another Target. They pretty much had all of the same things. They did have a few more Tree Hut body scrubs. They had a strawberry one, but the one that I picked up was this Tropical Glow Firming uh, Sugar Scrub right here. And it, the packaging obviously is so, so cute and it smells so good, y'all. This is how it looks right here. Honestly, it smells like a mixture of a couple different scents, but um, I've been in love with the Tree Hut Body Scrubs. If you have not tapped into the Tree Hut Body Scrubs, highly recommend it. I was definitely sleep on Tree Hut for quite a while, but it really does leave my skin nice and soft. And the beads in this, they're they're pretty they're pretty big but they do a good job dissolving down once you are rubbing them in so yeah i really really love tree hut scrubs so i'm trying to build my collection and this is from target i will link it down below for y'all so that way um if they still have it y'all can pick it up but i think i paid about nine dollars for that even though 
I remember them being $6, but honestly, everything that went up in price. So that's all that I picked up from Target. So we, again, we're just gonna go in order. I'm gonna show y'all what I picked up from Dollar Tree. Um, so like I was telling y'all, I picked up an exfoliating washcloth from Dollar Tree. This one is a little bit more rougher, so I probably will use this maybe once or twice a week. Um, but if you are looking for an exfoliating washcloth, this was $1.25. Pretty much all of this was $1.25. So I picked that up. Um, I also picked up this exfoliating uh, facial mat for my face. So that way I can put my face wash onto this and you know really exfoliate my face also picked up some baby wipes this is by fisher price this is made with 99 percent water it does also have aloe vera and chamomile in it as well i actually did use them already because i was out and i needed you know i, I needed them um but this comes with 64 wipes so quite a bit for a dollar 25 so i actually just recently started using baby wipes because i was definitely that person that was like i don't like it when i'm wiping i don't like it to be wet down there i don't know it just gave me this weird type of feeling um, but honestly, since I've been using baby wipes or since I just, I, since I've been using wipes in general, you smell cleaner overall throughout the day. So if you have not switched over, I would definitely go ahead and switch over because it's really going to make you smell fresh and clean throughout the day. So highly recommend picking this up. I think, um, Mc McKenna, McKenna, cause I keep saying her name wrong. McKenna, she actually was like, you don't wipe, you don't wipe babies with tissue so you know why would you wipe yourself with tissue and i was like girl i feel you you are absolutely right so guess what i'm gonna pick up some wipes as far as oral hygiene i picked up this colgate two-in-one toothpaste and mouthwash i actually thought this was like an on-the-go type of situation like I, I, don't, I don't know what I thought it was. But anyways, you actually do use this with your toothbrush, but it did catch my eye because it's a two-in-one. So it's saying that I won't have to use mouthwash along with this. So we'll see how it goes. Um, if you've tried this, let me know how you like it. So I got that. So I didn't realize that that was like a toothpaste that you actually use. I thought again, that it was just on the go. So um, I picked up this Optic White Colgate toothpaste it is a little bit smaller than what you would find at like walmart or target but honestly it was a dollar 25 i think it'll last you a little bit so let me show y'all what it looks like so this is how it looks so if it's just you that's using toothpaste honestly i would say this should be fine so i picked that up they do have a whole bunch of different um types of toothpaste at dollar tree though so if you are looking for something more affordable i would hit them up um i did also pick up this dove nourishing body care cream right here i'll probably use this more as like a hand cream um just kind of like throw it in my purse but let's smell it so this claims to provide up to 48 hours of moisture this smells like some type of Avon lotion. I'm not gonna lie to y'all, but I think it'll be perfect to just throw in my purse and call it a day. But that's actually all that I picked up from Dollar Tree. So we are just moving right along. So the first thing that I picked up was this Aveeno Daily Moisturizing Body Wash. Y'all know that I have been saying that I've been wanting to pick this up. The one at Target for some reason though smelled very weird to me. I don't know. This smells so good. It has this very um, clean type of smell. Honestly, it reminds me of some type of like baby fragrance. So I really, really love this. So I definitely wanted to try this out. It does claim to be very gentle on sensitive skin as well. So if you do have sensitive skin, you may look to get this. Um, I went ahead and picked up some of the Dove lotion. This is the mango and almond. And I absolutely have been obsessed with the mango, the Dove mango scent. So I was like, definitely got to pick this up. And this lotion, y'all, I love it because it's so, so lightweight, um, but it does still moisturize you at the same time. I think it says that it provides up to 24 hours of moisture. Yeah, I think this may have been 4 or $5, but this is how it looks. This is just a tongue scraper brush thing. And I've been wanting to pick this up, honestly, and I just have never done it because my toothbrush has like a little thing on the back of it where you can like clean your tongue but this one has this these little ridges on it so it's really gonna really clean your tongue so this is especially important because honestly you know if you're not cleaning your tongue that's that's where like 80 percent of the bad breath comes from so definitely wanted to pick this up so i can get a nice and thorough clean for my tongue so i got that y'all i was so excited about this because i just thought that this is something that was out of season and maybe it is and they just had it at this walmart but this is the brown sugar and cocoa butter body scrub 
You guys know I am obsessed with the Dove Exfoliating Body Polishes. This one does have brown sugar in it, so I'm assuming it has, it's gonna give you more of a rougher type of uh, exfoliation. Um, yeah, so even right here it says that it's a deep exfoliation. Now with the Dove Body Scrubs, I actually, honestly, it's something that you can use daily like the other ones because they're so gentle. So this one I'll probably only use a couple times a week just because it does have those bigger beads in it. And this is how it looks. Um, I think it'll actually go good, really good with the Dove Pampering um, vanilla, Warm Vanilla Body Wash. So yeah, if y'all tried that, let me know. So I picked that up. And then the last thing that I picked up from Walmart was this Olay um, Nighttime Rinse Off Body Wash or body conditioner. This one also has B3 in it, but it's made with retinol, which is gonna, retinol is really good for lightening up like dark spots and um, rough areas and stuff like that. So I definitely wanted to pick this up. I did not get to smell it in the store. So let's smell it y'all. It pretty much almost smells the same as the other one. It just has a little bit of a, a different type of backdoor scent, but it does smell really, really good. So if you do like the this one, I think you would like this one as well. This is more so for nighttime. So wanted to pick this up. So I'm so happy. I love these y'all and they're so cheap. They're like $5. So the only thing I will say though, is I wish that it came with more in it, like a bigger bottle, just because um, I, I can go through this pretty quick. I ended up going to Trader Joe's as well. Um, I did pick up some flowers, which are in the in the living room. I picked up some white roses, and y'all, if you are looking for some cheap, affordable flowers, um, then I would definitely go to Trader Joe's. I think those are like eight dollars versus when I go and pick them up at like just my regular grocery store, they're like twenty dollars. So definitely go ahead and check out Trader Joe's because they are much, much cheaper there. I just like to get flowers because they make me feel good. And yeah. So anyways, I picked up those. Uh, I did also pick up some new eucalyptus right here just because um, the one that I've had, I've had it for a while. So it is definitely time to switch it out. Um, even though it still smells pretty good. But y'all, I absolutely love the smell of eucalyptus. Putting the eucalyptus in your shower has so many different benefits. I like to put it in there because number one, it makes it smell really, really good, but eucalyptus actually does help or claims to help reduce stress. And um, yeah, I'm all for that, anything that I can do. The steam from your shower actually, I like to say that it activates the smell of the eucalyptus when my shower is going, like you really can smell it. So so yeah, if you're struggling with some sinus, with sinuses or anything like that, pick you up some eucalyptus. Uh, if you don't like the smell, I don't really know what to tell you, but I love the smell of eucalyptus and pretty much everybody that I know doesn't really mind the smell of it. So, and it just looks cute in the bathroom, y'all. It just looks very cute in the shower. If you are looking to spruce up your shower, that'll do it. Plus it has a ton of different benefits. Um, that's actually all that I picked up for today. Thank y'all so much for 1700 subscribers. Y'all are showing out, y'all showing out. Um, so definitely make sure that you subscribe if you are not already, give this video a big old thumbs up and definitely leave a comment down below on some of your favorite hygiene products so that way I can check them out. But yeah, y'all, until next time, I will see y'all in the next video. Peace.